Hey, what's going on guys and welcome back to a brand new video and a brand new episode and on the channel today um, it's a it's a like a two a, I want to cover two points one is airflow and uh, two is we need to clear we need to clear out the greenhouse um, and we did a video on this uh, a couple like a long time ago but um, we didn't do it well enough, so it's uh, and it's all become really um, packed again. So we need to, uh, so we need to have a little bit of a sort out. So that is a thing that we're going to be doing today. But first, I want to talk about airflow. So um so just so just a minute ago you you saw when my dad was just taking you around you might have seen that we had some peppers hardening off and we need to harden our grapes off as well because these these start need to start going out before it's too late in the season um and as well if you follow us on Facebook we uh, we've done two live streams in a in a, well uh, we've done a, a, how do I put this? We've done a daily live stream for two days now, and they're very short. They're only about thirty seconds, really. They're not very long at all. Um, but I hope maybe we can do some longer ones soon. Um, but it's basically, we had a. I think it was the first day that we did the live stream on Facebook, and um, it was also my first video. And basically, there was a rotten tomato, or the bottom was rotten of a tomato, and it was probably the biggest tomato that we had. And because um, you also you just saw that the two grow bags where the peppers and so where we had the uh, the peppers and tomatoes in the two grow bags, um, they had but in the two grow bags have become so close together that um well the plants have become so close together that there isn't enough airflow, so things are starting to rot away. So we're going to clear the greenhouse and then I want to show you something else. So we've got a lot to work to do. So without further ado, let's, uh, I guess, uh, let's just start. So um, this is the last of the, like, clearing out the pots. And I'm just bringing up the last lot of it now. Um, my dad brought a big chunk of it up. So we're going to get uh, quite a bit more work done and maybe then we'll come back. So already in the space of about five minutes, maybe not even that, we've created so much room. And where we haven't actually been able to get in, there's a few weeds and there's one here that I'm going to pull. And then there's a really big one um, in the corner. So we're going to have to move some bits to be able to get in there. Or my dad's going to have to get in there. But, um, but yeah, just in like five minutes is how much room that we've actually got. Okay, so my dad is moving a grow bag just so we have a little bit of space. But the really good news is um, that we've actually found uh, quite a few good tomatoes and, and quite a few of them. And there's actually one that's coming along really well and it's just here. Um, so, it, so it's just tucked away by the board a little bit. Um, but, none of, but looking around, none of them are at the red stage yet. So we did this a long time ago, but we didn't get to finish the job. Um, basically, it was putting, well, it was uh, getting the lower leaves off of the tomatoes. So now that we can get in there, I'm going to get in there with the secateurs and cut some off. So we're getting right back to the stem. So I'm going to cut here. Right, so that's that one off. And if we come along right here 
right so you can see there's a little pile there and we'll do a little bit more and then um we'll get back to doing a few other bits with the clearing the greenhouse so um as well as the um the tomato leaf the yellowing leaves we also did that with the melons and any of the pepper leaves that had been in contact with the ground and um basically this was the melon so you can see it was yellowing and it and it's not doing the plant any good so we've done a few more of them and so that will all go on the compost heap i think so you can see it isn't as much of a pepper forest um but um so we're going to find areas for the on the patio for them and uh including our tabery and grapes as well and um, the grapes are probably going to stay there for the moment But yeah, just before we round off the episode, um, you can see, now that they're outside, you can see that we've actually got some grapes um, coming through. But yeah, as I said, mm -hmm. um, so this was a bit of a different episode. There, well, it was gardening, but it was more maintenance than anything. Um, but sometimes it needs to get done. Sometimes gardening isn't, isn't just about the sowing and the planting and the looking and whatnot. Um, sometimes it's about the maintenance as well. But if you did enjoy it, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. And as always, don't forget to slam that notification bell so you're notified when I upload my brand new videos. Um, if you did enjoy it, I'm sure as always, you will. a few of you might comment. Um, I, I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can. Obviously, if you comment late, I might not see it until the morning or my dad will comment for, or for me. And there's two videos popping up now. One is was the one is the last Friday night update that we did, and the other one is the first um the first part of the strawberry bed. So there's two videos for you to choose from then. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed. As I said, uh, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Um, but I will catch you all in the next one. Uh, and don't forget to go follow me on Facebook and Instagram. It is Grow Your Imagination without any spaces on both of them.